Hey, good day. God bless. Welcome to the Daily Reminder. Why don't you hang out here with us for a few moments. Once again, this gives us an opportunity to share a verse or a thought, hopefully a nugget, something that you can carry with you through the day, hopefully something that will inspire you enough that uh, can carry you through the day. Just remembering, just the idea of reminding, just remembering what Peter, when he was writing abroad, said, Second Peter chapter 1 and verse 12, he says, Wherefore I will not be negligent to put you always in remembrance of these things, though you know them. And you are established in this present truth. Peter saying, listen, I know you know that, but I am not going to stop reminding you and setting it before you and keeping you in remembrance of those things that you already know because it keeps us stirred up. So listen, in this season, and, and, I, and I've just seen this with so many people, there's a lot of people that just feel like they're in neutral. They feel like they're spinning their wheels and going nowhere. A lot of people have just kind of sunk back into the mindset, I just want to survive this season and just get to the other side of the season. I'm weary of the season. But listen, in this season, we keep moving forward. In this season, we keep pressing forward. In this, in this season, we keep m- moving towards the goal, the high call of Jesus Christ. Listen, naturally, moving forward means one of two things. You're either walking or you're running. That's how you move forward. But when you look at it from a spiritual perspective, it's the same way. Because the Bible says this in 2 Corinthians chapter 5, and verse 7, that we walk by faith and not by sight. Our walk is to be a walk of faith. It moves us forward. Hebrews chapter 12 and verse 1, the Bible says this, where says this, Wherefore, seeing we are encompassed about with so great a cloud of witnesses, let us lay aside every weight and the sin which so easily besets us, and let us run with patience the race that is set before us. So Paul, or Paul writing uh, uh, to the church of Corinth says, Listen, your walk needs to be a walk of faith. The writer of Hebrews says this, listen, as you're running, as you're moving forward, you need to run with patience. Why is this important? Because in Hebrews chapter 6 and verse 12, the Bible says this, we are to be imitators of those that have gone before us, who through faith and patience inherit the promises. We inherit what God has intended us to inherit, inherit through faith and patience. And I was just, I was struck by the Amplified translation with this one verse. Let me read this for you today. In order that you may not grow disinterested or become spiritual sluggards, be imitators, behaving as those who through faith, by their learning of the entire personality on God in Christ, in absolute trust and confidence in his power, wisdom and goodness, and by practice of patient endurance and waiting are now inheriting the promises. Listen, I know things feel weird and it feels like like things are shut down and locked down, but we continue as the people of God. We continue to move forward through faith, through patience. Both are necessary to presently inherit the promises that God has for us. God bless you. We'll catch you next time.